Okay, so what I have here is a uh, is a Generac 4000 EXL generator. I just got my hands on yesterday, and I fixed it. Well, not completely yet, but uh, almost fixed it. Well, it's running now, so that's good. I just need to replace the um, sensor for. Uh, um, for oil so the low oil sensor but right now it's running without it so what I'm gonna do here I'm gonna convert it to the propane or natural gas really easy and really fast so this generator would be kind of uh, difficult to connect through the return hose for the uh, unburned un, uh, fumes which actually which is actually right here and goes inside a frame or inside a cover and then, then goes back into the filter box so I decide to use a different method on this one this is actually kind of attached here so I don't want to fuss with it besides if I want to go <coughs> back to the gasoline it might be uh, difficult to reattach this. What I got is this thing here that is pretty much a Home Depot um, I don't know part for a hose plus extension on the other side which is actually pretty much like two nuts. Let me just unscrew it so you can see it. Okay there it is just like that and I'm gonna drill a hole right here into the box, into the filter box, right here on the side, and install these two pieces here to hook up the hose here. We all know already that if we mix the, the gas or the propane properly with the air, we're gonna get a good combustible mixture and the generator can run of it or run on it. So let's uh, get to it and I'll show you the final product. Okay, it took me about uh, five minutes probably to do this. So this is what you have. This is the drill I used. Okay, now this is a, I believe, a quarter inch, uh, uh, not three eighths. This is probably 3 8 uh, hose. Yes. And here is the carburetor. So this will get sucked in nicely right from there. Alright, let's put it together and uh, let's see how it works. So we have this hooked up from, uh, from the house. Natural gas again. And uh, the generator didn't run. So bear with me a little bit because it's kind of cold, okay? The choke is completely open and let's see let's give it a little flow uh, turn it on of course, let's see what's gonna happen <laughs> natural gas and you want to go back to gasoline all you do just put a little cap like these uh, pencil erasers those work pretty well right over it okay or wire nut and you're ready to go 
Are you just going to guess? Well, turn the gas on. Wait a little bit. I guess half of the choke. And let's see. something that will fit perfectly. I hope you enjoy it.